by Bethany Minnell, news reporter a man with a pipe bomb strapped to his chest caused chaos in New York after the device went off in a crowded subway tunnel near Times Square. The bomb exploded during morning rush hour, at around 7.30 a.m. U.S. time, in a busy passageway linking two subways underneath Port Authority Terminal the nation's largest bus hub. Police believe that the bomb described by police as a low-tech device went off prematurely between 7th and 8th Avenues on 42nd Street and could have been intended for a busier destination. Armed police and fire crews reacted in force, with all trains from 42nd Street diverted and roads closed to traffic. Video The moment the New York bomb went off the suspect has been named as Akadala, a 27-year-old Bangladeshi man who is believed to have lived in the U.S. for seven years, and was reportedly based in Brooklyn. He has been arrested and is now in hospital with non-life-threatening burns to his abdomen and hands. Police, who have labeled it an attempted terror attack, say Ella was inspired by the Islamic State but had apparently not had any direct contact with the terror group. Analysis NY bombing is reminder of daily threat to cities video suspect in custody after NY Subwa blast officers say the crude explosive device was attached to his body with Velcro and cable ties. Surveillance footage captured the moment the bomb went off in the tunnel, showing a man being blown to the floor. Commuters can be seen covering their heads and running from the scene, as the passage fills with smoke. A photo taken shortly after the explosion shows a bearded man on the ground, with his hands in cuffs behind his back. Image armed officers at the scene near Times Square His clothes appear to have been ripped by the force of the explosion and his midriff looks burnt and covered in soot. People on the scene describe chaos underground following the explosion, and a stampede as people ran from the station. Three other people were injured in the blast and are now in hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. Security has been stepped up at transport hubs following the bombing, which comes two months after AD in a New York City terror attack carried out, in the name of his image, subway trains were diverted and road were closed. New York Mayor Bill de Blasio said this is the most resilient place on earth, we proved it just over a month ago, we proved it on 911. The terrorists will not win, let's get back to work. Later, Donald Trump said the bombing proved the U.S. must fix its lax immigration system. The U.S. president added today's terror suspect entered out country through extended family chain migration, which is incompatible with national security. My executive action to restrict the entry of certain nationals from eight countries is just one step forward in securing our immigration system. Congress must end chain migration.